Imagine getting all the new patients you want without ever having to walk into a doctor's office again. We went from zero patients uh, to up to 180 patients per week within a year. And I did not have to go out and feed the doctors. Imagine increasing your patient volume by 75% in less than eight months. That's after being in practice for 14 years. Imagine having the administrative structure set up in your practice so your practice is expanded with or without your direct participation. I don't need to be there in order for things to run smoothly. Welcome to Measurable Solutions. In this short presentation, we are going to open your eyes to a brand new approach to running a physical therapy practice. You will hear from owners just like you who wanted to learn practical data on how to better approach the achievement of their ideal practice. In addition, you are going to be introduced to the fastest growing executive training company of its kind in the world. A company that teaches their clients how to control every aspect of their practice. I am actually in control of my organization. It's no longer controlling me. After a year of opening our practice, I know that we control the practice. Wow, okay, well on a scale of 1 to 10, definitely um, control is at a 12. Hi, my name is Jeff Lee, co-founder of Measurable Solutions. My partner, Sean Kirk, who's a physical therapist, grew his practice by ninefold by implementing the procedures that we now teach here at Measurable Solutions. You'll get to tell you his story a little bit later on on the DVD. Now, I've been training and consulting health professionals for the past 22 years and there's one piece of advice that I give to my clients that are trying to find the best in hiring an outside firm and that is find somebody who can practice what they preach and can back their production up with statistics. Now how do we measure our success here at Measurable Solutions? By our client success. The average client who does our program increases their patient visits by 420 visits a month. They increase their income by $36,000 a month on an average. Now that's what I call results. So in a period of about a year and a half, you know, we've gone from 130 visits a week up to over 500 visits a week. Back then, I mean, I was just buried in work. You know, the nice thing now is I don't need to be there in order for things to run smoothly. We had risen drastically for the first two or three years of our business, and then in the last two years before I came, we had flattened out. We were in a flat line, and me and my wife, who was my business partner as well, we, we decided, so well, we're going to have to do something. And what happened once we got here, in the two-year span, we've doubled our patient growth, we've doubled our business growth, our production, our income. And now, here is Sean Kirk, physical therapist and co-founder of Measurable Solutions. I was chicken. I just hated, I absolutely hated to go out and talk to doctors. It started out me blaming everybody else, right? I just, I, I was doing that 24-7. I'd sit down at the dinner table and I'd complain about all the other practice owners in the area and what's wrong with them, right? And then when I realized it was just me, it was me, it wasn't them. What is it about me that's keeping my practice from growing? And once I really spotted what I was doing wrong, I started doing the right things. It took off like that. We believe that a private practice owner should be able to have his practice expand with or without his presence so that he can have the time to do what he wants, right? That's how, that's how we focus. Everything that we do is towards that. So starting with the new patient course, it lays down precisely how to make this thing happen, driving business in the door without you doing it. And that's exactly the viewpoint that we give to anybody that comes on board to do the new patient course. How can you get somebody else to do that and still see rising statistics? When I came to the new patient course, I was contemplating closing two of the three practices. Um, we were in pretty severe straits and I didn't know why. I blamed the insurance companies, I blamed the doctors, I blamed, I had, my employees were just stupid, they weren't doing their work. Uh, well, I come to find out that it wasn't all of those things, it was, it was the whole organization um, was suffering. And so, when I came for the new patient course and for the executive training, I went back and immediately, I mean I immediately put every single thing I had learned into practice. And our statistics have gone up by about 75 to 80 percent since April. We're now in December, so we're talking about eight to nine months of time that we've increased 75 to 80 percent. 
That's after being in practice for 14 years. When a physical therapist signs up for a new patient course, they come to our training center in Florida, where they participate in three specific actions designed to boom their practice. First, you will meet other physical therapy owners that have determined to make a change. You'll hear their specific situations, including what they want to improve about their practices. Next, you will sit down with a highly trained consultant and outline what your practice would look like if everything were exactly the way you wanted it. Once your ideal practice is identified, you and your consultant will determine what barriers you'll need to overcome in order to achieve that ideal practice. You will discuss what has worked for you in the past and what hasn't worked. Instead of just getting a marketing strategy for your practice, you will learn the guiding principles behind what makes a strategy successful or unsuccessful. You will learn a proven time-tested formula for dramatically increasing your new patients. In two short days, you will become skilled in simple, easy to implement procedures that are extremely effective. New patient worries will be a thing of the past. We closed out our January with uh, 864 visits that month. And I was working like crazy. I was doing about 40 hours a week. And then plus with the documentation time and weekend time, I must have been putting in a total of about 65, 70 hours a week. This August, um, eight months later, I didn't work at all the month of August myself. I didn't carry a regular schedule. And we closed out that month with like 1,636 visits. So we had a significant increase in production and a heck of a lot more <laughs> time for me to really get done what I needed to get done without having to have to treat so much. And it's, it's given our, us our freedom to do other things that we would like to pursue. And ask us two years ago if that would have been possible and we wouldn't have known how that would have been possible. I started a new patient course last year. My stats start shooting up immediately starting January and they still keep going up to, up to this point. I just said to myself, wow, this thing really works, you know, and <laughs> it just blew my mind. It's like, a, it's like magic for me, you know. It made total sense to us and we uh, went back, implemented the data that we learn from the new patient course and um, we again this was a practice that was already successful we thought it pretty well plateaued in terms of volume and it grew another 33 percent almost well I'd say within the first eight weeks of our implementation of that of the program that they had sent us home with. Putting out the money on the new patient course of you know that of course was like you know, am I going to get something out of this? But just a few of the suggestions that Jeff and Sean gave us at the new patient course, I was able to go back that following week and implement within two months. I mean, I had recouped probably 10 times that amount of money. If you put as much time and energy and money and effort into being a business owner and a manager and administrator and executive, if you put as much time, energy and effort into that as you did becoming a therapist, think of how well your business would do. You know, and someone said that to me and the bell went off and, and you know, if you keep doing what you're doing, you're going to keep getting what you've got. And so it really took that commitment to make a change and for me, those two things were massive realizations for me. I needed to make a change. Call Measurable Solutions now if you feel it is time to make a change.